Hey everyone, TAC14, Sawani1 here with a uh, Call of Duty a Black Ops 2 video. Haven't done one of these in quite some time, basically because I haven't played the game at all, but I decided, uh, what the heck, I'll uh, hop on this just for a little We're bit and fight. see how I do. And this is actually the first game back and I actually did quite well, so I decided, you know, why not do a commentary, uh, you know, had a pretty good game and haven't put out one of these in a while. So. Anyways, also, I, for whatever reason, it cut off the size of my video. I don't know the rendering process from ITV to Camtasia messed things up. That happens sometimes, and it took forever to export. So I, I, I don't think it's too big of a deal to completely start over and you know spend two hours doing that. But uh, I'd like to just get this video out. hope that's okay. I think the quality is still pretty good, despite the sidebar things but basically I am using the uh, PDW look at that nice C4 kill but I'm using the PDW I completely forget the name of this map it doesn't really matter too much um, but this is actually one of my least favorite maps which is kind of funny how I do pretty good on it and the PDW um, I, I think it's a pretty good gun I've, I've found it to be the best for me at least one of the best for me uh, but I, you know, everyone's kind of different. Uh, it kind of just depends on the map and stuff like this. I think the people that were playing this game out in this game in this lobby weren't that good. I just maybe, yeah, I don't know. I <laughs> I took a break from COD because it was just getting really annoying. I felt like every single gun was one shotting me, and the spawns I just couldn't handle. Like I pretty much sneak up behind their entire team right here because two of them spawned and then. I almost, yeah, I do get that guy, wow, okay, <laughs> and oh, okay, I died from that guy, but I do, I do pick up my lightning strike, my kill streaks are UAV, uh, care package, no, not UAV, hunter killer, hunter killer, care package, and then that lightning strike, uh, lightning strike normally at least gets one kill, if you're lucky you'll get multiple, as this guy is trying to steal my care package, and I will have none of that, but uh, hunter killer usually gets a kill, at least one. Uh, so I kind of like those. I kind of like the kill streak setup, and I like to go through them. A good thing about this game, even though they had a lot of flaws, I feel uh, overall they had the right, you know, notion, the right uh, ideas about a lot of things, or a lot of gameplay mechanics. It was just, you know, some of the spawns and and gun balancing was a little off. But as far as like the perks go, and and the uh, I, I guess the kill streaks and all that stuff. Uh, it, the, guy, the game, I don't know. Those were pretty good. It's just some of the stuff just kind of turned me off and made me want to stop playing. But I, so I did stop playing for quite some time, as as I've as I've said. And I came back into this game, and for whatever reason, I felt like I wasn't really you know trying that hard at all. I wasn't really playing too well or anything. I was just I I was just doing really well and. Uh, you know, maybe it was just the bad lobby, as I said, or maybe, you know, people have just stopped playing completely, and now all the you know, quote-unquote bad players are here playing now, or maybe I just got in a lucky lobby. I'm not really sure, but my question is, are you still playing Black Ops 2, uh, or have you decided just to completely quit, and what is your stance on uh, this game compared to other Call of Duty games? Uh, at first I thought this game was really good and then you know obviously I got really tired of it got really bored of it really really fast compared to other games uh, whereas like in a uh, bunch of the the more uh, games at the very beginning of the series such as um, <clears throat> World at War I think I played the most of obviously Call of Duty 4 I played that game the most out of any of the COD games and that game never got boring and if there was still people playing that game, I'd, I'd probably still be playing that game today. It's just no one's on that game, so it's you know pretty much pointless to play because all the people that play are pretty much just hackers, and you can't get into a lobby unfortunately without a hacker. It seems maybe maybe one out of ten lobbies I'll get lucky, and then it'll actually be a really fun game. Um, but other than that, uh, it's really tough to play that game. But, you know, obviously, uh, World at War was really fun, and then Black Ops was really fun. And even even uh, Modern Warfare, the first one, or Modern Warfare 2, I guess it was, uh, I, I found that enjoyable, even though a lot of people 
hated some of the perks that people abused. I felt like that game was really good. You know, there was a bunch of stuff in that game that was a little off, but overall I think they got it right. And then Modern Warfare 3, I got really tired of that really fast. And, and I played it for a good month and a half, two months. But, you know, I was really looking forward to Clan Ops in that game, and it never came out. And then this one, I just... It just, I don't know, it was like... I felt like it was the most boring of them all. Or I just got rid I got bored of it the, the quickest. Um, but I hope they do rebound, I really do. I haven't really looked into too much. I know they released something about, like, uh, a game that's, like, called, like, you know... Black Ops Ghost, or not Black Ops, Call of Duty, like, Ghost or something. Um, I didn't really look up too much about it. That's what I've heard. Um, I hope it's a good game. I haven't even played the campaign of this game yet. Um, I plan to do that. I might make it a Let's Play. I might not. Um, I haven't really decided. But I will be playing through the campaign probably after I finish the Halo 4 campaign, which I'm playing with amp if you want to check that out it's a really fun uh let's play that we're doing it's dual let's play obviously we're going co-op through the campaign on veteran mode uh some of some of it's hilarious some of the missions are really tough and some of them are kind of funny to play and you get our reactions and stuff and some parts are really really annoying but uh we eventually hopefully we'll get through it all and uh it'll i think it'll be a very enjoyable uh, let's play dual let's play to watch but on back on to this game a little bit you notice i've you know i've gone through my kill streaks pretty good i've gotten at least uh, i think one or two lightning strikes at this point and i think i might get another one uh, before this game ends so things are working out really well we have a huge lead over the opponent and uh, for whatever reason this guy thought it was a great idea to go prone behind that barrier uh, for whatever reason, some people in this game are just, they make me wonder why they're playing this game. Uh, I bet some people think about that when they're shooting at me sometimes too. Uh, but nonetheless, uh, from this care package, I managed to get yet another counter UAV. I wish I would get something good. Care packages can be very, very good if you, I mean, obviously, I mean, obviously speaking, it can be very, very good if you get something good in them, because... It can completely change the game around, can completely get you a ton of kills. Uh, you know, eventually sometimes you get like Reapers, or not, I don't even know if they're called Reapers, but um, some of the really, really good kill streaks. And watch this uh, nice double kill up ahead right here. I get a C4 kill. This guy thinks he has me, but I drop shot him like a boss. And then just run into safety. Uh, we are approaching the final kill here in a second, so I am going to wrap things up. I do hope you enjoyed this, uh, please, uh, if you want to answer those questions of the day that I asked. If you forgot what they are, uh, they'll be in the descriptions. Uh, basically, your thoughts on this game as of now and stuff like that is pretty much a general question. Uh, but I get one kill here, and we need two more kills to go. I, I hear someone in my reload, while well, I'm reloading, I hear someone over here. I can't get the C4 on him, but we do win the game. I do go a really nice 32-3. and three. That 10 plus KD and the leader of our team by far. I hope you enjoyed this and I'll see everyone next time. Peace.